Beckham alienda akatuacha with my dad. My dad akona miachua mzigo. Sasa ikabidi ametuacha. Wakaniachia mtoto wa nini 2 months. Nikaanza kumblea with my sisters. My, my sisters wakienda shule mimi naenda tu na mtoto kwa shamba. Nafanya kazi ndio tunawalisha sasa mimi. Naitwa Vivian Mora, niko form 1 in Finley Secondary School. Mimi kutoka nikiwa mtoto mdogo nimepitia shida mingi. Sometimes I ask myself why I was born. Mimi nimejaribu commit suicide when I was young. Nimejaribu like three days. Mara kwanza nilijaribu commit suicide. Ni nikitaka kunywa dawa ya panya. Nilijaribu lakini kitu inaniambia ni nisikunywe. Ni Nikaenda kunywa kitu tu inanikataza. The second day nikajaribu kujirusha kwa mto. Third day nilipatikana nikijaribu kujua na kamba ni nikachukuliwa kakatazo ni acha kujua nini ilifanya ukaanza kukuwa na hizi thoughts za kujua cuz mimi my life ilikuwa so hard mm. nikiwa in class 3 my my mom wali nini wali divorce with my father my mom alienda akatuacha with my dad my dad akona nachua mzigo sasa ikabidi ametuacha wakaniachia mtoto wa nini 2 months Nikaanza kumblea with my sisters sisters Sandio my my big brother alikuwa in form 2 yeye alikuwa anaenda na shule saa mimi kabidi nimeacha shule nikaanza kulea my my last born our last born sasa ilikuwa inabidi naenda na tafuta nini kibarua kwa shamba kwa by birthday tunafanya so also believe ndio tunakuja Yes, so much. Can so much. Na na by my India, nini seventy. Na enda na 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 nini na shiaga na ten ten twenty bob zinzi na baki na enda na by na by maziwa na chumsha mtoto na kunywa. Kishiaga yonga tunatumia two days. Nini asubui na asubui na sasaba tunat tunakunywa uji. Jioni ndio tunapika nini ugali. Lakini mbaga ikuwa ngumu juu kwa tunajipandia siwe nyewe. Tukua tunastruggle tu kuenda kibarua, tunalima. My, my sisters wakienda shule, mi naenda tu na mtoto kwa shamba. Nafanya kazi, ndio tunawalisha sasa mimi. My brother alikuwa naenda nga shule. Inabidi jione amekamu, amearakisha kutoka shule, anakuja. Na hepi anenda kutafuta kibarua. Kuna mtu wa hoteli menye, tukua tunapeleke nga maji, 20 liter, 20 liter moja. Ni 20 shillings, sa hiliko inabidi tunapeleka mara tatu, tuna, sisi sa si tunatengeneza wa 20 mbade. Sa hizo nizo zikuwa zina saidia kwa nyumba. Tuseme nika mwaka ndio ilinaenda kuhisha, ndio my mama alikamu. Kachukua mtoto na sister angu sa mwenye anafuata na last born. Kainda ngana ea, tukabakia na sister angu mwenye ananifuata na my brother. My brother your time, ndio alikuwa naenda form for. Sa my my sister mwenye ananifuata tukaenda kwa shamba tukachuna kasava tuka tukapika sasa vile tulipika aziku ivanga kwa tukakula sasa tulikuwa tunasikia ziki wakali my sister aka tulikuwa na njaa sana my sister ndiye alikuwa amekula hizo kasava mingi mimi nilisikia ni kali nikachananga nazo nikaenda kumwambia acha akasema ya yeah, naisinja kaendelea kukula Sa six ikifika, my sister akanyambia ana feel so bad kwa nini yake juu ya ukali ilikuwa ina mu affect kwa nsikia kutabika kwanza akanyambia mimi even mimi naona nika nitakufa nikamwambia acha kusemeti utakufa kwanza akutabika mate eh niko nanga hiyo imezidi sasa ikabidi nimetoka usiku saa sita kaenda nikaita neiba neiba akakuja kashikiana na brother yangu akapeleka my sister hosi kufika hiyo hosi my sister akakosa hewa anaongezewa maji 
sasa ikabidi pia mimi nime nime nini simu ikapigwa kwa awanaiba mwingine akambi wangu anikuje juu pia mimi hiyo nini inaweza ni affect kapelekwa usi ndio nini wazazi wangu akapigiwa simu akatafutwa akakujanga usi sasa vile walikujanga usi my dad akakujanga senye my sister ndio tunaenda kupona sasa akalipia nga my sister ya katoka nga usi sende kauliza ngo ambano unalipia mwenye akuwa meafe, mwenye alikuwa mgonjwa sana unamtoa hosi unacha mwenye akuwa ameaffectiwa akusemanga kitu akatoka nga hosi akatoroka akaenda my mom akabaki hapo tu akinilinda sasa vile alibaki kama ananilinda ikabidi nini wana kijiji wamechanga pesa nikarudi home my uncle alinchukwanga kaenda kukana mimi na vile alinchukwanga mimi nini bibi yake alikuwa anamtesa sana life haikuwa nini rahisi hivyo mimi nilipitia shida na, na nashika na na moshi nini nyumba nafanya kazi ya nyumba yote watoto wakitoka jioni shule na share uniform na panguza viatu na paka rangi sasa ndio mimi asubuhi kitambo mimi nijitayarishe niende shule nipate ina eco late sasa nikienda chaki niuliza mbona umechelewa na muelezea sasa siku moja kanitumanga nilete wenye tuna nini wenye tunakaa na hao kwenda home kuwaita my anga kaenda nga shule kwenda shule akaulizwa kwa nini mimi niuenda late akaanza kuongea vibaya na ticha lakini ticha nilikuwa nimemuelezea akuchukulia anga hivyo vibaya sana sasa ndio my anga nikirudi jioni home akaanza kunichapa akisema eti sijui na toa story za home na peleka shule nikiambia ticha sasa kanichapa alikuwa anatumia waya stima kunichapa ama anatoa nini belt ananitandika nayo sa mimi hadi mtoto me nilikuwa na watoto wenye nilikuwa nashughulikia the first born sa yako in form 3 saa hapo ndio sikuwa nenda nga shule hivyo for now sa hii ndio ningekuwa nakalia nini mtani wa nini form 4 saa juu ya kupitia shida ka hizo when that is when ni rudi nyuma after that my, my the sister of my mom, mom akanikujianga kanileta nga huko Nairobi kapatananga na mampoli kamuelezeanga ndio mama kaambianga mampolina kaambianga unadi mimi niko na nini program yenye nafanyanga so unaweza waleta tu ni niwe tu nikiwafanyia counseling saa hapo ndio tulikujanga kwa mampoli kanza kutufanyia counseling saa mimi niko nanga ina jan turudi huko kwa sister my mom nikaongeana na mampoli ndio sa tukakujanga with my sis, my two sisters Mam Pauline alichukua ngatukiwa mimi nikiwa class 5 For now tuko na f- like 5 years here Vivian was very low learning and she was crying every day akukana yeye analia na muza Vivian what's wrong when you ask her nini ni mbaya Vivian atalia 2 hours na stop And that is when I understood this girl is has a problem. That's that's nikakana e one year nikampeleka shule Faith Christian School with the Maureen Kwamboka. And uh, that is when wakaanza shule. Mwalimu ananiita na niambia this girl has a problem. She is crying two hours kwa class au gay na mtu analia tu. Kaambia I'm trying to do her some counseling and this is what is happening. I didn't have money to pay their school fees but uh, because of love because one thing I came to notice in life is sharing love to the community. And when I showed Vivian I embraced her na akaniambia kwa maisha yake anjai hagiwa nilimuhagi tu hivi akaanza kukulia nikamza kwa nalia vitu zijai hagiwa na mtu hivyo nimesikia vizuri akaanza dia akaanza ku open up my mom my mom ni ni mgonjwa hiv mshaenda kumtembelea sometimes yendo kama tutembelea oh yendo anakuja mm alimuuliza ni kwa nini aliwaacha aliwajibu waje nilimuuliza anga akasema eti sasa ni vile alionanga wanasumbwa na na my dad kwa nyumba sana my dad hadi akuwa anataka kutusomesha juu ni baba wa kambo sisi vile tulienda class 
term two, fee ikuwe memaliziwa yote. Sasa ikabidi chameleta shida tukapele kwa mama katuchenge mama Polina katuchenge ingi shule ingine tukenda kusome huko kwanza njoo atwezi kae nje na nini KCP ilikuwa karibu asa hii the Vivian is secondary with the more uh, more in form 1 but uh, they didn't do their third time exam we have been having debts like now standard 8 mwalimu ali hold their results because of 18000 nikaenda kuongea na mwalimu wa secondary finalists akawachukua bila any results but pia finalists kuna ndeni ya 75000 um, more uh, Vivian na Morim angeta kwenda shule ya serikali ya government but they need uniforms they need everything also Vivian was telling me mom ningepata boarding school mimi naweza furahia sana nisome because you know na mtu akisema anataka kuwa lawyer ni mtu atakosete sana kimasomo a mtu akitaka kuwa judge mtu atakosete sana kimasomo and Vivian is very bright by the way hata tukimaliza kazi tufanye vitu there are times hata tunayafanya kufua nguo tunaosha maviombo tunafanya uh, Vivian is hand very hard working she has to go back to her books and she kusoma tukiwa na mampolin sometimes tunasaidia nanga kuna anaenda anafanya sometimes kazi ya kufua nguo tunasaidia na na yeye anapata nini pesa na mimi sometimes kuna wenye wanajua na jua kushuka wanakuja na shukia watoto wao lines za kwenda shule ana nilipa like 50 ama so tunatumia kwa nyumba for example vivia for example no for example anita sometimes we even pray for people with them mimi ndio nakuanga lefali <laughs> tunaenda games tunacheza pamoja tunacheza kati if you meet me with them i showed them that i'm a girl like them i was once a girl now i'm a woman so they are they are my girls and uh my vision ni, ni to be a lawyer and I need to take care of my family when I want to have a now I'm a city now I'm being my story in the room yeah now I'm just my story come out and I'm just the music guru who take care of what's gonna be in a when you want to have a come on me you get but I'm meaning to have a good to skill yeah I'm a summer with my sisters mbaka tumalize shule ni ngesema asante sana na ninasema asante sana kwa mampoli kwa kazi ambayo amefanya juu ametulinda kutoka kuja huku life yangu imebadilika imekuwa poa sana my sister mimi nilifuata nataka kuwa judge na mwingine anataka kuwa prosecutor hiyo ni kitu yenye tunapenda like a family na ni kitu yenye iko kwa hati yetu na tungependa ndio tuweze kusaidia watu wengine wasichana wengine wasichana wengine wenye hawana haki wenye nini hali yao ni ngumu hivyo kimaisha keep smiling <laughs> keep moving keep going masides <laughs> for example <laughs> 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 <laughs>